practical medicine. Um, and uh, they really want most of us that are going for board certification to work at a zoo. The bad news is, as far as a zoo goes, depending on the zoo, you may only have 20 or 30 species yeah. that you work on all year round. Right. Um, being a private practitioner, I can do wildlife. I can come in here and see 30 patients in a day that are exotics, you know. Well, you, were, you can't even recommend it from every place we call. We were trying to find a place closer to the house, but mm -hmm. it, this you and this place came up every time. We okay, well, the, the, me being here is kind of new, but, you know, me being on the coast, I've been doing this for 20 years. Yeah. Um, and uh, so I, I try to be good. I, I'm, I'm human. Please never forget that I'm human and I dress really funny. Okay, so um, a man who dressed like this is going to have a sense of humor, so bear it's with not. me. It's just uh, about the animals, that's all I know. Yeah, <laughs> I can't be one, so I got to dress like them. Um, so anyway, you know, uh, we'll, we'll do our best, but uh, I, uh, I just, uh, you know, back to the YouTube channel, I document a lot of these cases because, you know, when the time comes, I'll be able to sit there and say, well, the YouTube channel has over 1,400 videos on it. At least 11, 1,100 of those are all patients that are mostly exotics, okay, okay. including snakes, lizards, and whatever else goes on. Um, okay, all right, we got that going. Last video, crying terrified. Mm -hmm. She's super sweet. Boom. Stop it. <laughs> okay. It just, it's got that face that says, I just want baby. <laughs> Judd! <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> 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 All right, come on, girl. Yeah, she's pretty heavy, too. I'm not going to watch her at least 50 pounds. Oh, you're done. It's okay. Right, let's try this first. You let me know what you want me to do. And I've had a snake that had a respiratory infection in the past, and you know, I checked by looking up its lip on the side, and you can see a bunch of bubbles on the side, and I never saw that with her. Mm -mm. Nope. Don't bring any teeth. <laughs> well, there's our trachea right there. I'm waiting mm -hmm. for it to open to see what's on the inside, see if it's red in color. You can see the little redness down at the base of the tongue. Yep. Open it a little bit. Yeah, there is some mustard tract infection. Come on, hand me a swab. Without pooping on yourself. Yeah. <laughs> you can't, you can't, you can't pregnant people. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> it's not <a> <laughs> Especially how long I've been doing this. <laughs> Open up. <laughs> Are you looking at Peter and his eyes right now? I'm actually getting a sample. How's that for cool? <laughs> One man show. <laughs> I'm leaving for it. That's me. You're asking for help. You're asking for help. <laughs> That's Dr. Roth. He's the other vet veterinarian here. <laughs> Doesn't do much of the exotic side? Huh? Does he, not, does he not do much of the exotic side? No? Let me see this. Okay. And she's really weak. It's okay. There you go. Okay. So I'll calm down now. All right. Let me put this on the microscope. Okay. Things that, that worry me, okay, um, she didn't have a very grand negative foul smelling breath, okay, so I feel like her respiratory tract infection is is new, yeah. you know, it's not that old, it's not that long, but her skin, even if she's getting ready to shed, still looks really, really rough, okay, yeah. um, so I'm, uh, I'm just, I've got questions about how well she's eaten over the past several months to a year or whatever. Sure, about the book with me. Okay. I can definitely get that information to you. Okay. All right. You should have had that for a What? Because it looked cool. <laughs> 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 I 
give me a few minutes. I'll be right back. For my end, it looks great. <laughs> No. Man, her skin does look like she's getting ready to shed. Now I see what this light is. I think our aluminum is our aluminum is never really that bright. So it's kind of hard to see. But I noticed this sheen color happening in the last couple of days. Is that usually what happens before she sheds? Yeah, it'll get smoky. And then her eyes will, will get cloudy. smoky, cloudy, and then. Uh, you know, shortly after that, within a week or so, she usually she should, you know, snake will shed.
It's a picture. picture. <laughs> <laughs> it's an <laughs> Look at that. He's like, I'm back. I'm not looking at it. He's going to baby. <laughs> oh, baby. Stop. 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 Stop.